I'm standing in front of the Tietval monument to those missing on the Somme, that's to say those who could not be buried. And I'm here because we're visiting the site of Mamet's Wood, the uh, engagement in which David Jones took part and which he wrote about in, in parenthesis. So the Germans were actually in retreat as they were... Yeah, and then they came, the next phase was to come down through here, which is why I thought we should walk yeah, this yeah, way, because yeah, this yeah. is where he, yeah. you know, this is exactly where he went. And here are the remains of this trench. You can see it kind of winding along. If, you, if you're walking up here and you didn't know, you'd assume it was a sort of, you know, sort of ditch or something, yes. Uh, I mean, already what's in Jones's text is incredibly demanding because it's this mixture of soldierly life and, and daily detail and involvement in a completely mystic and mythological understanding of the conflict that he's in. And it's important for me emotionally and, and psychologically and atmospherically to have some sense of where it all took place. And then he says, all alone in the deeper shades, caught between Rowan and Hazel. Foxes are fleeing, unicorns break cover, the Warrens are in shock. The birds cry out as their nests fall like stars and their airy worlds gone crazed. <laughs>